We are live. Listen, technology is just like, wow. So I did not come on and do the live yesterday because I was figuring things out. I was getting ready for the challenge that starts tomorrow. I was learning new technology. And I have to be honest, right? Even coming on now, I was like, how do I make these things work? But I am feeling good. I'm feeling confident. I'm feeling ready. And it is day zero. We are about to kick off our five day 2021 clarity challenge. And yeah, I'm ready. I am excited. I'm somebody who, um, usually doesn't really get nervous about things and i've been really meditating on why am i so nervous about this why am i so um you know you know those goosebumps that you get those butterflies when you're about to do something and i just realized it's because i just care so much i want to give proper information i want you to feel challenged during this five day 2021 clarity challenge so yes that's why i am so nervous and i wanted to come on here this is my personal facebook and so after today's live this is going to be the last time i come on live on my personal facebook so from tomorrow i will be going live on the facebook group which is called the five day 2021 clarity challenge so i really want to say to you that if you have not joined that group yet i want to encourage you and say join the group um the sign up for the challenge is on my website again i will put the link on here i've been emailing people it's been it's been awesome but it's also been a learning curve and today i want to talk to you as we build up to next week i want to just give you a lesson on perfectionism um it's really been one of those things that i have been challenged with in my personal life i've done a video about perfect perfectionism on my youtube channel and i really think that it is a fear-based response we don't do things because we wait for them to be perfect we wait for them to be amazing and then we release them and as i was going through this process of preparing for this challenge and really feeling like oh my god it's not perfect you know throwing small tantrums at home i had to come to a place of peace and saying if it's not perfect can you you've done it and you're going to learn from it and that's what i want to encourage you today like don't not do things because they are not perfect if it's not perfect do it work on it while it's already been out so this is the lesson that i want to carry with everything that i do with my things and the way that i carry myself and the way that i really want to center myself into the work that i want to bring out to the world and i just want to encourage you as well to just forget about it being perfect forget about it being having no mistakes that's the other thing you know we're like we don't want it to have any mistakes we are human beings making mistakes is in our dna making a mistake is in our, it's that it's the thing that makes us human it's one of those things that make us human so i want you and all of us to get to that pl place of knowing that it is absolutely okay to make mistakes it is absolutely okay to not be perfect it is absolutely okay to just move with things as they are but challenge yourself take that courage to go forward and do the thing and the very first challenge that i want to put out for you today is this join this 2021 challenge listen just to give you a taste for tomorrow we are going to do one of my favorite favorite exercises and that is beginning with the end in mind i do this with all my clients beginning with the end in mind it, it's a it's an exercise that i learned from a book called the seven habits of highly effective people and he says begin with the end in mind and work your way back to the beginning and you know i don't want to give too much on this live but that's what we are going to be doing tomorrow that's what we are going to be learning we're really going to be getting crystal clear on what we want this year 
Audrey Lord, one of my favorite people, says that those who don't have intentions in how they live, they just you just live recklessly because you don't know what you want. You don't have any intentions. So tomorrow is really where we're going to start setting those intentions on how we want to live for this year and for the years to come. So yeah, this is where I want to end this video. Also, before I go, I really want you to um, invite your friends to the challenge, invite your uh, cousins and your sisters and i really think there's power or your or your circle your circle that encourages you that wants to see you grow and prosper and every just people who hold you up you know so my goal is to really create a hub to create a community of doers people who don't just talk about things but people who actually go ahead and do them so invite those people if you know them tell them to join the challenge i will I'll, I'll tag them on this video this is the last day after today we are getting to work and so as i said this is the last live that i will be doing on my personal facebook if you're watching this on youtube i'm also going to share the link for where you sign up for the challenge on the description below where you can sign up for the challenge and i will see all of you tomorrow uh, the live will start at 11 o'clock my time which is 11 a.m pacific time so if you are also add a link on here for a time converter so you can know exactly what time to be there show up early show up ready bring a bottle of water bring a journal and a pen but most importantly bring an open heart and bring a spirit that is ready to get going ready to start off this year with fire with power with juice with excitement with purpose with ambition but most importantly to start this year with action i am excited as you can tell and i am ready if you have any questions you can dm me on my facebook or you can send me an email on my website i'm there ready to reply and yes i'll see you guys tomorrow Mwah. Bye.